Welcome back to the garage. Today I just want to go over with you how to install the trailer hitch on a 2023 plus Honda Pilot without having to remove the rear bumper cover. Uh, you will need to change this silver panel. Honda says you have to take the whole bumper cover off to do it. Um, I'm going to show you how you can do it without taking that panel off. You're still going to want to refer to all the instructions. This is not a complete how-to. This is just my tips and tricks on how to get that silver panel changed and how to get the harness in without removing the bumper cover like Honda does. So first thing you're going to want to do is come under here, remove all these clips. You got one here, one here, one here, and then you have a bolt over here. And then up inside, you want to get that clip, these two screws, and that clip up there. Uh, if you want, you can take that Phillips head out there as well. Then, what you need to do is get your hand all the way up in here. And up in here is where your 10 millimeter bolt is. It's right around here. So you're going to put your fingers up in here between the floor pan. And here you're going to feel around for it. What I used was a 10 millimeter gear wrench with a really fine tooth and you can work that right off and you're going to do that on both sides. So you're going to go over on this side up, up in there. You're going to see the support and you're going to feel around for it and you're going to do it here. And then once you have all those fasteners off, this silver panel is going to come right off for you. and then you can swap it out. So once you have the silver panel off, then you're gonna put the hitch in. So here's your hitch right there. You're gonna mount that, and then you're gonna put your silver panel back on. Uh, a tip for me is if you're doing the harness, you wanna put the harness bracket on first. So the harness bracket's right here. Put the harness bracket on the hitch, then mount the hitch up. Uh, you're gonna have all your hitch bolts over here, 21 millimeter torque those to spec my recommendation is when you go to put the new silver panel on do not put any of these fasteners back in until you have those 10 millimeters in up there because you'll want this to move and flex because now that the hitch is in there you got less room to get your hand up in there before the hitch goes in you got all the room in the world so you're going to want to leave these off until you're done just remember to put them in when you're all done. Leave them off till the very end and then just go back in there and, and put all those fasteners back in. Okay, so if you opt to install the wiring harness for the hitch, um, this is kind of what's in store for you. You'll remove this pocket on the driver's side and that's where all your, your jack tools are so it's really easy to remove. It just has two little thumb screws and the pocket pops right out. Um, the harness comes in two pieces and the first thing you'll do is install the internal piece inside the car and basically up in there is where the harness will start that white connector and it'll clip that in and then you'll run your harness you're going to install this bracket and fuse box here and then run the harness all the way through that pocket and you're going to bring the harness out underneath and it all snaps in the place. This box here, you're gonna mount that with the bracket as well. The harness is in two pieces, so the external piece you'll mount to the hitch and thread up through, and then it comes through this grommet right there, and then it plugs in. I'll show you what that all looks like from underneath the car. So the second half of the harness, you'll start here. You'll install the harness, uh, on the hitch at this point here and then you're just going to run the wire all the way back so it's going to come out here you'll secure it to the hitch and then you're going to run it through that that grommet spot right there through to the inside of the car and then it'll plug into that black controller box in the back so there you go, that's just a little overview on how you can install your hitch and harness without having to remove the rear bumper. Once you're all done, you'll be ready to go. You can tow your, your uh, trailer or your snowmobiles, jet skis, boat, whatever you got. Or like us, you can use a bump step so your golden retriever can get into the back. Like, subscribe. 
Drop any tips that you have from your install into the comments. Talk to you soon. Thanks.